Today, today I'm gonna to be making a plain orange chicken panda express orange chicken and fried rice. I'm gonna make it orange cauliflower. Okay, we're gonna start first by cutting up the cauliflower. So we're gonna cut the foot of it. While I'm chopping this cauliflower up, I do want to tell you why cauliflower is good for you. Cauliflower is rich in vitamin C, folate, vitamin K, zinc. It's high in potassium and fiber. It contributes significantly to a healthy heart and it's anti-cancer. It's excellent for skin protection against UV radiation and there's so much more. Consider cauliflower a super food. So I'm going to cut these all about the same size so they can evenly cook. Okay, so to make it crispy, we're going to be adding some cornstarch, seasoning with salt and pepper, and a little bit of some Goshugaru Korean pepper flakes. Goshugaru Korean pepper flakes. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna mix it. Okay, I think that's evenly mixed. So we're gonna put this on the side and start making the sauce. You're in the dark. I know I told you to stay, but look at me. Oh, what a puppy. What a puppy. You look scared You're <laughs> I'm gonna start by chopping some garlic and ginger, and that's it, I'm gonna start with that. Okay, let's go. I love chopping garlic. This is the last garlic I have. I'm just gonna finely mince. I'm glad I filed my knife, or Sarah filed my knife. Who's Sarah? A girl. I met. Actually, I'm going to the ginger. I'm going to use this thing to shred it so it's finely minced. Let's go. Look. Look, it needs to be frozen. So it's so much easier to mince or shred the garlic when it's frozen. In the freezer. See, it's a pretty Ooh. good amount right there. Let's do a little more. Okay, so now we're gonna be squeezing some orange, and I don't have a squeezer or anything, so we're just gonna use our hands. 
I already took out all of the seeds. So just squeeze a whole orange. Look at that. Nice. Look at that. Nice. I'm going to I'm going to eat the rest. Saving the planet. Metal strong plastic cup. Someone went and got their nails clipped earlier. He's feeling a little They sent me away. Right, Suski? That's good. That's good. Okay, now we have our cauliflower ready and our sauce, so let's get to cooking. So I'm just making sure all the sides get a little bit of attention. And, um, this isn't burnt, it's like crispiness, all right? Looks good, so now we're gonna be adding the glaze. And let's just lower it a bit. and we're gonna let it cook there for two to three minutes so the sauce gets thick Now we're gonna be making some fried rice to pair this up and then we're gonna feast. Okay, I'm letting the brown rice cook about two to four minutes without moving it to get crispy. Then I'm gonna transfer it to a different container and I'm gonna cook on the same pan the veggies and the egg and then combine them all together. And then we're gonna add the sauces and mix them all together to make a nice fried rice. Okay. 
Okay, this is looking good. I'm just gonna top it out with some sesame oil, some toasted sesame seeds, and some green onion. Okay, we're all done. And now we have this delicious orange cauliflower with some fried rice. Look at it, so good. And I'm gonna be eating these with some lettuce cups, some romaine, so let's dig in. And also, sorry, I'll turn the side. Must have a lot more later. Um, let's try it. This is like an easy way for me to have more greens. Okay, let's try. I also really like the crunch from the cauliflower. There's still a bit of a crunch. It wasn't cooked all the way soft, which I like. And so this is crunchy and just delicious. All of our favorite flavors, really. Mm -hmm and nutritious like come on so i'm just going to continue eating my lettuce cups let me know down in the comments if you're going to try it and um i hope you enjoyed and like it see you soon